Good morning guys, YouTube people, world, everywhere. I totally forgot and spaced about this. These uh, also tools, they sent me these five piece precision cutting wheel. Um, totally forgot about them, they were shoved way back here and since I haven't been doing any cutting lately, <clears throat> I forgot all about them. Sorry also tools. <clears throat> um, anyway. So here we go, uh, maybe I'll do a little bit of cutting today with them, um, but yeah, looks like they're four and a half inch, four and a half inch, uh, max speed 13,300, four and a half by three sixty fourths inch thick by seven eighths inch arbor, <clears throat> and there's all the, the metric sizes. Kind of hard to see, but 115 by 1.2 millimeter by 22.2 millimeter. Um, <clears throat> I guess a CMPA Hanover, maybe Canada, Canada. But anyway, um, they're really thin, <clears throat> really really thin compared to what I use. I usually use these because I get them at the swap meet. Um, maybe they're not that much thinner. Um, these are a 16th inch. So I get these at the swap meet because uh, I know the guy that sells them at the swap meet. Um, and I usually pick up a pack of like 25 for like 20 bucks. <clears throat> so... This is what I use, but I definitely can use these because they're, you know, obviously four and a half inch. Um, and these things, these things sound like a helicopter on the grinder. They just... Um, because they are... I don't remember, six inch. So, here's the size of those. Six inch by sixteenth by seven eighths. So, let me see... Yeah, these are, you can tell, well, hold, on, hold on, let me get them up. You can tell that uh, also tools, theirs are thinner. Um, by a tiny, tiny hair. I don't even know if you guys can even see it. <clears throat> um, is there metric on here? Yeah, so this is 1.6, so this is 150 by 1 1.6, and this is 1.2. <clears throat> the thickness um so anyway this is what i use um they work pretty good they wear out pretty fast um they wear really quick um up until they get to like four and a half inches um but anyway so i want to try these out <clears throat> these should cut a lot a lot quicker um it does say the max is thirteen thousand three hundred and these are 10,200 so um I don't know it's got all these warnings uh complies with EN 12413 standard MPA certification <clears throat> use safety goggles and machine guards what's a machine guard anyway Obviously, I can't use a machine guard if I'm using this one, so I obviously don't ever use machine guard. Um, but yeah, anyway, um, <clears throat> I forgot all about their tool they sent me, which is pretty cool. I'll put a link in the description below. Oh, oh. There's the part number, part number 1216, it's five pieces. Um, uh, made in China, probably not making any anymore right now because of the coronavirus. So, anyway, um, but yeah, so yeah, I got these, I want to say about two, three weeks ago and I totally forgot because I got them, I got all this parts, lights, LED lights, parts for the truck, brakes. Just all kinds of stuff. Um, and uh, this got shoved back in here somewhere. 
<clears throat> because it's nice and neatly packaged. But anyway, so I'm going to test these things out. I'll uh, probably do it on a review. Um, Got to get back to doing some tool reviews. Uh, today's Saturday, so um, I just wanted to get this video out there. I'll put a link, like I said, in the description below. Also tools, five-piece precision cutting wheel. Um, really thin. I've always looked for really thin uh, cutting wheels. I can never find them this thin. Um, I can only find them at the swap meet um, from the one guy, <clears throat> but he doesn't always have them. Um, and then, uh, like, Home Depot has them, but the ones at Home Depot, when I use them, I don't know what it is. I go through them, like, cutting, like, three inches of steel. So, anyway, that's going to be my Osa Tools product of the day. So, alright, guys, thank you for watching. Click the link below. Check them out. They got all kinds of other stuff. They got tool bags, tool organizers, um, <clears throat> torque wrenches, all kinds of crazy stuff. Um, really nice torque wrench. Um, it's really light. Um, I like the way that they feel compared to the spring style one. This one weighs like, I don't know, eight pounds. This one probably weighs like, I don't know, five pounds, something like that. Anyway, they're a lot lighter. Anyway, go check out their, their website, olsatools.com. Like I said, I'll put a link for that in there. Maybe put a link for the wrench in there and some other products uh, that they've sent me. Sorry, guys. Thanks for watching. Later.